Today we're going to be looking at Python a little bit more and we're going to be looking at using a Telnet uh, protocol in it. Uh, so we're going to create a client side script means, which means we're going to connect to a server. I have two terminals open up here. One of them I'm going to set up as a server. Uh, but first let's create our client in Python. So I'm going to start up Vim as my text editor and I'm going to call this my telnet.py I'm going to start my edit mode here and I'm going to say uh, pound exclamation point user bin python and then we're going to import telnet lib so the telnet library we're going to say host and we're going to set this variable of our host set to what would normally be the IP address uh, of your server we're going to be connecting back to ourselves so we're just going to say local host and next we're going to create a uh, telnet object so we're going to say tn for telnet and we're going to set equal to t the telnet library so telnet lib dot capital T telnet and within this we're going to say host and then we're going to set uh, what port we want to connect to and we're just going to say in this case normally the actual telnet if I remember correctly is port 21 you can set any port on this though let's just uh, say uh, 999 and we'll close that off uh, I think that might have to be in quotations there there we go okay so now I'm gonna hit enter and now we're gonna say um, so now that's what's connecting us to the server uh, and now we can write something to the server so let's say you want to automate a command being written to the server we'll say take our telnet object we're going to write and then inside parentheses we're going to say hello world within quotations and we'll even put a new line command there and then our next line we'll say print TN, so our telnet, and we're going to say read all. And what this is going to do, so let's go through this code. Uh, we're starting up Python, we're importing our telnet lib, we're setting our host to our local host, and we're going to connect to local host at port 999. Then we're going to write plain text to that host, hello world, new line, and then we will read any uh, data coming from the server. Uh, although I think doing it this way we won't get that information until we disconnect and uh, we're just going for real basic in this tutorial we're going to have more tutorials on telnet and socket later on but I just want to get you the basics here so we're going to save that and we're going to make it executable so change mod plus x and the name of our file and we're going to do dot slash name of our file but now we need to set up our server first I don't actually have telnet running I'm just going to use netcat because I like using netcat. Uh, you do have to be uh, sudo or root for this. So we're going to say sudo netcat and we're going to say dash l for listen and we're going to listen on port 999. Going to hit enter there and it's waiting for something to connect. So let's run our script and see if we wrote everything right. We'll hit enter and there you go. You can see on the server screen down here we automatically got hello world written out on the screen that was sent from our script up here. We're going to hit Control C to kill that out, and it read back. Uh, we got an error because we hit Control C there. If we didn't interrupt it, if we had actually, uh, let's do that again. We'll start up Netcat here, and we'll run our script again. You can see we got Hello World. I can type stuff down here. Nothing is coming up in our top screen up here, but if I hit uh, Control C to disconnect down here, so the server disconnects, at that point, everything will be sent. Um, once again, we're going to get into more detail in the future. I just wanted to give you the basics of connecting to a Telnet server. Uh, so, uh, thank you for watching. Please visit filmsbychris.com. And also, I have a forum set up. This code and other scripts will be at uh, our forum here under Python. And uh, the link to this is uh, filmsbychris.com forward slash forum. The link will be in the description of this video and also chat with us on IRC. There's a link in the description for that as well, but it's filmsbychris.com.
forward slash IRC to chat with us there. Thank you for watching and have a great day.